hold mine. I can't even see your hand. Gas is freaking 265 a gallon. It is. John Boy's birthday. Yeah, it's John Boy's birthday. He's six years old. It is a scorcher. I hope. I hope this is the last hot, hot days of the summer. I'm ready for fall, cooler temperatures. I'm yeah. Ready for, I'm ready for a hoodie. It's it's so hot that schools are calling off today. Yeah, hundreds of schools in our state in Ohio <clears> here, guys. But not my school. kids. Yeah, and our kids where Sean goes, the elementary school has no AC whatsoever. And I mean, I've been in there. That school's a scorcher. <clears throat> got it? I got it. All right, guys. So, so many people ask me, what kind of striping kit do I have on this mower to stripe lawn so good? I don't have a striping kit, guys. The biggest thing you have to know is what height to cut each lawn at. That's the biggest thing. This lawn here, I can pull up, I can look at it, and I can say, okay, it's hot out. It's going to be in the 90s all week. There's no rain in the forecast. This lawn sitting right now is probably at about four inches. So I'm just going to take it down to probably three and a half inches because with no rain, 90 plus degrees, yeah, it's going to grow a little bit, but I do not want to burn the lawn up, okay? You want to keep those roots, you want to keep the grass as tall as possible to keep those roots hidden from this sun, okay? Because when the sun hits the roots and down into the soil, that produces weeds. Keep it a little bit taller, keep it a lot greener. It's gonna keep it more moist being taller even during the hot weeks. And uh, it may prolong you or give you enough time to when you're gonna get some more rain to keep it nice and, you know, moist. Moist. <laughs> <laughs> took an inch off of it maybe but you don't need to cut super low every single time now in springtime you can get away with that a little bit because you're getting six inches eight inches a foot of growth sometimes but right now in the dead of summer we're here at September 4th. 4th yeah you gotta pick your pick your times to cut and what heights to cut at it's so critical at this stage because I could cut this lawn right now, guys, at two and a half inches. And guess what? Next week and probably the rest of this month, when it's going to be almost 100 degrees all week, this lawn's going to brown up in about two or three days. And I guarantee we come back next week, it's probably going to be just as green, maybe a little bit of browning in it, but we're going to be able to continue mowing this for at least all of September. Keep profits up. All right, guys, so Savannah's going over to start mowing the four acres on this one. And I'm going to go ahead and trim the ditch out. I had to record me because I really wanted to focus in because a lot of I've been getting a lot of questions on this lawn lately about what striping kit. I mean, you can see underneath that mower, guys. There's no striping kit on it. All right, guys, Savannah's almost done here. Probably been close to an hour. 
this property goes down and around the road guys I can't tell how far it goes man this kind of branch over here but it actually goes there's a tree way down there it goes down to that tree Grab this stick for her real quick before she runs it over. These trees are massive. it's a scorcher today it's only 11.05 and I'll tell you what I guarantee it's 90 degrees Did. He just said it really grew. Throw this leg in the trash can. No, oh, that's got water in it. He must be uh, cleaning his trash can out. I'll just put it in this big one. Sounds good to me. I'll go get this other stuff that just magically appeared. Must have been in the road and he's kicked it up into the yard. Ugh. So how's everybody doing? How's everybody uh, dealing with this heat? Yesterday I was running rough. Video surveillance cameras are installed. Uh oh. Tell you what, it never felt so good to hop back in the truck with the air conditioner on. I'll tell you what, man, it's freaking, I don't know, man, it's scorching. I think it's just because there's not a cloud in the sky, and that sun is just beating on you. I mean, it's beating you down. Hey, there's a big sail. We should stop it. Not. It's too hot, too hot. 
But yeah, we're rolling on through them, guys. We're gonna let Savannah get out here and mow on this next one because it's hot. And she wants to work on her tan and bring the gun show back, don't you? You wanna bring the gun show back? You mean this? Yeah, exactly. Look at the gun show. Woohoo! <laughs> Alright, guys, let's keep on going. Alright, guys, quick stop at the freaking bank. I had a check. <laughs> I had a check from a business, guys, that I just found. I don't know how the heck. I set it on my desk at home, and I covered it up. And, yeah, Savannah found it. That'd be fun to mow. Down in there. Nice little retention palm. So, yeah, we got a check. I was, I was going through my book, and I'm like, man, they haven't paid in a month. And Savannah's like, no, I remember getting a check. And I'm like... I'm checking the bank statement. I'm like, I never deposited. So we started looking, started looking here. Put it on the desk, covered it up. Forgot it was there. Ugh. On this whole keto thing we're doing, you can actually get a bowl from Chipotle. No beans, uh, no rice. Just a lot of the carb stuff, huh? No corn. No corn, yeah. So I got steak, cheese, sour cream, tomatoes lettuce I think that's about it. oh I got cheese. a side I got a side of guac also cheese. I said cheese oh. <laughs> and uh, Savannah got chicken and pretty much the same thing I got yeah but she got her guacamole on I, I don't mind guacamole but I don't like it covering all my stuff like hers it just kind of throws the whole look off so yeah we're gonna enjoy a little bit of lunch here and then uh, we're gonna get back at it all right, guys, we've been running through quite a few here. Not really filming much, trying to get stuff done because we're trying to get done in time so that we can uh, enjoy a little bit of Sean's birthday before Miley has practice tonight. It's uh, going on two. We got to be done here. We got to be done here by about three. All right, guys, so we stopped and picked Sean's cake up real quick. Got him some gifts in the back, some slime and stuff, some things he'll really like. Uh, new PlayStation controller. I think he'll be pretty darn happy with his gifts. Yeah. So, uh, like I said earlier, guys, we were just rushing, rushing, rushing because we had to get out and get stuff for him and then get home for the kids for the bus. So, yeah, that's our day, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. As always, keep mowing. Keep growing. Keep making money, boys. We'll talk to you later. Peace.